This screencast provides an overview of the solids processing blocks available for use in Aspen Plus software. Aspen supports several solids operations. The crystallizer, which produces crystals from solution based on solubility. The crusher, which mechanically processes solids into smaller particle size. Screen, which mechanically separates particles by particle size. Single stage washer, or S-wash for short, which recovers dissolved components and entrained liquid using a washing liquid. Countercurrent decanter, or CCD for short, which models multi-stage recovery of dissolved components and entrained liquid using a washing liquid. Dryer, which evaporates liquid from wet solids. Granulator, which increases particle size. Classifier, which separates solids based on settling velocity. And finally, fluid bed, which models fluidized bed units. We will go over the crystallizer and dryer in detail in the following modules. Aspen also supports several solid separator blocks. The cyclone separator, which models the removal of particulate from gas. Venturi scrubber, or V-scrub for short, which atomizes the scrubbing liquid to separate solids from gases. Centrifuge filter, or Cfuge for short, which facilitates sedimentation through centrifugal force. Rotary vacuum filter, or filter for short, which separates slurry components after passing it through a vacuum chamber. Cross-flow filter, or CF filter for short, which selectively filters solid particulate in a tangentially flowing liquid. Hydrocyclone, or high psych for short, which selectively separates slurry through centrifugal force. Fabric filter, or fab fill for short, which deposits solid particulate on fabric material. And finally, electrostatic precipitator, or ESP for short, which removes unwanted particulate and gas through electric charging. We will go over filter in detail in the following modules. Watch the following video on the YouTube playlist to learn how to model a crystallizer in Aspen Plus. For more Aspen Plus tutorials, visit the Cornell CBE YouTube channel.